I'm Sarah with Bedbug Heat Doctor Prevsol, and we are here to walk you through step by step the BK10 unit. Now remember, all of our units are made right here in the United States to guarantee quality. The BK10 is for apartments, hotels, camps, homes, hospitals, rescue shelters, and more. The BK10 is used for 400 square feet and rooms and areas that have 120 volt power. Depending on availability, you'll get this Air Master High Temperature Fan or the X Power High Temperature Fan. Let's get started with step one. In this step, you'll cover your sprinkler heads. You can use styrofoam covers from a local hardware store or call us to order more. Also available in our premium package is the Stay Cool Sprinkler Cover. In step two, strip all bed linens, including pillows, sheets, comforters, and bed skirts. Make sure you also remove any mattress encasements and covers from the mattress and box spring. Wash and dry according to the manufacturer's directions. In step three, put the mattress and box springs in an A-frame on top of the bed frame. Leave headboards in place. It is not necessary to remove headboards. Unplug all electronics and light fixtures and it is okay to leave them in the room. If you have the BK10, you'll be doing one room at a time because it covers 400 square feet. In step 3B, place the BK10 unit in the center of the room with the airflow blowing toward the headboard wall. I just walked you through the bedroom setup, but if you're ready to move on to the living room, place the heater in the center of the room and use the fan to direct the airflow to circulate around the furniture. While you're in the bedroom with a closet, use the fan to move the airflow into the closet. Make sure your closet's not overpacked so air can flow through it freely. In step four, plug one cord into the machine and the other end plug into a 20 amp breaker. Repeat this with the other five cords using a dedicated 20 amp breaker for each plug. Not the outlets, but use the breakers. During the heat process, it is imperative that you are not stacking clothes, stuffed animals, or blankets in a pile. This process should be bagging up as much of this as possible, taking to an outside laundromat. If you don't have enough power, you may also use a generator. In step five, cover all room vents, open all of the drawers, and close the bathroom door. In the last step, step six, you are now ready to turn the power switch and fan switch on. Run the equipment until the temperature reaches 135 to 140 degrees. At that point, use your thermal gun to check your cracks and crevices of the coldest spot in the room. Those temperatures we want at 121 degrees for three or four hours. For more information on the BK10, make sure you call the number on your screen or head over to prefsol.com.